Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I was editing the Marlon Amplifier part 2 and a courier pass over and bring me a parcel. So this is the parcel that I just received in the middle of editing my video because I'm planning to update my uh, working bench. As you can see, I have just a little space over here where I can work and then I have this cabinet where I'm keeping my computer for editing. So I ordered another table in order to put it over there, eliminating this cabinet here, like that I have space to keep two computers, the one that I'm editing and the one next to it with another monitor where I'm gonna do the, the project with Arduino where I can program the microcontrollers or stuff like that because recently I started that uh, playlist uh, about learning microcontrollers. So I need a bit more space in order to go with this playlist to make more videos and to show guys and to teach you guys how to program microcontrollers and how to interact with the sensors or displays or whatever a microcontroller can do. So without further ado, let's open this box. Let's see how looks the table. Let's see how it is good for my working bench and see how we're gonna mount it. Okay, so let's start open this box up. Okay, so what we can see here we have a nice metallic structure for the table. So we have the legs, a really good metal structure. We have some bolts, some that is going to be for the for the four legs, bolts, Allen, Allen key. How to install, guide. Let's have a look how looks the table. I received the table damage. You can see this corner is all damaged. I don't know if it's the courier problem or was sent it uh, damaged already like that, but you can see here it's definitely damaged this table in this corner. Let me have a look at the other corners to see maybe there is also other damage things on it. This corner looks okay. That corner okay. Let's see this corner down here. How it looks. So this corner also okay. So looks like maybe has all, only problem there in that corner. Also here I have this damage if you can see here. It's something marked on the legs. And also some more damaged also here in the top, as you can see. I already opened a case, return case, because I'm not happy with the table. It's all damaged. Also here there is another damage, as you can see. What a shame. I was thinking that today I can do... I can make my, my working bench upgrade. Another damage over here in the corner, as you can see it here. Yeah, you can see here is another damage on the paint and also they are not perfect square if you can look they are not at all they should be perfect square but are not at all and of course the other side the other side looks also the same you can see here is bent and uh, yeah it's not a great but anyway, I already opened a return case for the seller because as you can see I just opened the, 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 the table and everything is damaged. So I opened a return case and I asked the seller I want to replenish a good table for my money back and you can send me a label and I can ship you back my, your items because it's not my fault that I received the damage and it's not my fault to pay the, the shipping. Okay, so I think we're gonna continue with this video after we're gonna wait a few days until I'm gonna get the answer from the seller or from the eBay what we're gonna do with this, uh, with this case. So guys, guess what? Few days later I receive a new table. So now it's time to start upgrading my working bench. So first I'm gonna start removing everything over here like that I'm gonna have space where I'm gonna mount the new table that I receive. It. So let's mount this uh, table. So we have uh, the legs, table itself. Let me just find a scissor and let's start.
table is finished, let's just put it on the, on the right place. So that it will gonna be my working bench right now. So I'm gonna have more space in order to make some more projects. So here we go, my working bench is ready. Here is the working place where I'm doing repair and soldering and stuff like that. Here in this corner I'm gonna put all my equipment and uh, tools. I'm gonna have here the monitor of my computer that uh, I have inside everything from my working uh, bench like microcontroller programming stuff, softwares for designing schematics and stuff like that. Here I have this uh, amplifier that uh, I'm using for now, monitoring uh, the sound when I'm editing and in the top it will gonna stay the monitor for my computer that I'm using for editing. Then I have all the power cables already set up and all the connection for the monitors. Let's start putting back all my stuff in the working bench. Happy finally I finished uh, mounting my working bench. Now I have both of computer up and running. I have my working space over here where I'm doing soldering and repairing and doing my stuff. So this computer I'm using always for my working, like I have softwares for editing, schematics, PCBs, software for programming microcontrollers, all the libraries that I need for that. And how I mentioned on that video, if you don't see it, you're gonna find the link on the description below. I mentioned that I'm gonna start a new playlist where I'm gonna try to teach you guys for the beginners in how to interact with microcontrollers, how to program them, how to connect with sensors or displays or much more things that a microcontroller can do stuff. Then yeah, this computer is for my editing uh, videos. I'm using this amplifier here just to monitor my sound of my videos and if you can see I have another one over here so this one uh, I'm gonna have a video coming soon so please subscribe activate the notification bell to don't miss that video I'm gonna show you how much I pay on why is the reason that I buy it because how you can see it doesn't look a high class amplifier after I build that Hiraga that is a almost an audiophile uh, amplifier to go to this one but no worries I'm gonna have a nice video from where I buy how much I pay on and what's the reason that I buy anyway if you enjoy this video please put a like and uh, I'm gonna end up here this uh, video for today thank you guys for watching I hope you don't get bored and until the next video bye bye